Hey, what's up everyone? Today we're looking at a flyer advertising, promoting Morningstar Rising, the adventure game journal. A journal that, for instance, advertised games like Champion, Cyberpunk, Call of Cthulhu, and Star Wars. And Star Wars is why this matters to us. This item here, this promo flyer, really sits at the intersection of my two main sort of sub-interests in the Expanded Universe and in Expanded Universe Collecting. One uh, are promo materials. Uh, anything, absolutely anything promoting anything Expanded Universe, I absolutely love, right? And spend most of my free time trying to hunt down. On the other hand, uh, is my long-standing interest in with these really obscure areas of, of, um, of EU storytelling in the form of these non-Star Wars magazines that nonetheless contain connected in continuity Star Wars compatible RPG scenarios. Morning Star Rising is perhaps the most obscure, most impossible of these to find. Many come in the form of like officially licensed magazines that folks have heard of like Polyhedron and uh, Game Trade Monthly. I mean, a number of sort of magazines that anyone in gaming would know. But then you start to find more obscure and more obscure titles, many of which outside of North America and languages other than English, you know, everything from Swedish to Spanish to Portuguese. But then something like this, Morningstar Rising, which, you know, borders on fanzine as a not-for-profit journal, which, again, this advertises that you can get a subscription to for only 12 bucks by sending to this address in Omaha, Nebraska. I don't suggest anybody do this because this is an old flyer. But Morningstar Rising is so obscure and so impossible to find that I have often seen Star Wars forums where fans that are otherwise in the know about all things, you know, sort of obscure and RPG will actually claim that they don't believe it actually exists, that this is something that's sort of like internet fan rumor, because after all the searching they've done, after all the times they've been around sort of the Star Wars RPG block, right, they've never seen physical copies, let alone scans online, let alone even photos, right, of the cover or text of what's inside. Um, they do exist. They extremely, extremely rarely come on the market. You have to be right there, right place, right time. But there are three issues in Morningstar Rising that matter to Star Wars EU fans. Um, but rest assured, it does exist, and this flyer is obviously proof of that. So again, Morningstar Rising, the adventure gaming journal with articles on all these sorts of IPs, including Star Wars. What do these contain? Lavish descriptions of various games. Diverse Worlds, original reviews. As an independent nonprofit newsletter, they gave you the real story, whether the powers that be liked it or not, and reader contributions. Again, 12 bucks for an annual subscription out of Omaha, Nebraska. Got some cool images here. There's really nothing on the back. Um, again, just a pretty simple flyer, but um, with tangible physical proof. Morningstar Rising is real, and there are three issues out there that are very real indeed and very important to your full, complete, robust. EU collection. See you next time.